This video will show you how to use long division to divide four digit numbers by two digit numbers. On the screen you can see a division, 3765 divided by 15. First I'm going to set out my working out for this division. Now that I've got my division set out, I can move on to the next step of my long division. The next thing to do is to list all the multiples of the number I'm dividing by up to 100. So, because I'm dividing by 15, this means all the numbers that are multiples of 15 up to 100. So that's 15, 30, 45, 60, 75 and 90. I'm going to stop there because the next multiple of 15 is 105 and that's higher than 100. Now I can use these numbers to help me work out how many 15s there are in 3765. What I must do is use chunking. By looking at the multiples of 15 here, I can work out how many 15s there are in higher numbers. So, I can see that in this number there are 3000s because there is a 3 in the thousands column. I can see in my list of multiples that there are two 15s in 30. Using my place value knowledge, I can therefore calculate that there are 200 15s in 3000. I can subtract this chunk that I know from 3765. So, I'm subtracting a chunk of 3000. I'm going to write that underneath. I can then use column subtraction to work out this subtraction, first using a ruler to draw a horizontal line to separate my working out. 3765 subtract 3000 equals 765, so I'm going to write that underneath. As I subtract a chunk of 215s, I'm going to write 200 at the top of the division. Now I need to look at how many 15s there are in 765. So I must find a multiple of 15 that is as close as possible to 765. Using my list of multiples of 15, I can see that there are 5 15s in 75. Using my place value knowledge, I can therefore work out that there must be 50 15s in 750. This is another chunk of 15s which can be subtracted just as the chunk of 3000 was subtracted previously, so I'm going to write 750 beneath 765 to show that I'm subtracting this chunk next. I can then use column subtraction to work out this subtraction, first using a ruler to draw a horizontal line to separate my working out. 765 subtract 750 equals 15, so I'm going to write that underneath. As I subtracted a chunk of 50 15s, I'm going to write 50 at the top of the division. The final chunk that I have left is 15. I know straight away that there is one 15 in 15, so I don't need to subtract any more from that. As there is only one 15 in 15, I'm going to write that at the top of the division. Now my long division is complete. Looking at the top of the division, I can see that 3765 is made up of 200 15s, added on to 50 15s, added on to 1 15. 200 add 50 add 1 equals 251. Therefore, there are 251 15s in 3765. So 3765 divided by 15 equals 251.